Hey, it's time to talk about anomaly detection, which is the ability to identify unexpected events out of the ordinary resource utilization or strange activity in your environment. Because catching an event before it happens gives you a big advantage, especially when faced with the devastation of a ransomware attack. Attacks are getting more sophisticated, so human oversight alone is no longer enough. So here today to walk us through how easy it is to use the Net Backup Anomaly Detection Engine is Liji Karuvala, our technical marketing engineer. Hi, Liji. Hey, Sonia. Anomaly detection is super easy. You just toggle the switch to turn it on. And once you log into the Net Backup UI, you go up to the top right portion of the screen. There's a bell icon, it's the notification center. Here, click on Show All. And you have all the events as well as the anomalies carved out differently. So right now, this system doesn't have any anomalies. I've done a few jobs to train the system. It's a machine learning algorithm, right? So I'm going to go ahead and uh, refresh the UI because the job should have finished by now. And there it is. One anomaly has been detected. So let's take a look. So we can go under the notification center again, click on show all. Let's dive under anomalies and find that one job. So job number 35 looks like has got an anomaly summary of image size. Let's take a look. And the backup files count. So here we see, like if you go to the bottom lower left, the job only found six files, whereas the normal was about 78 to 118 based on what the system discovered as the baseline. It's pretty easy. You can go for right from here, click on View Job Details, and it'll take you right into the job so you can investigate further. That's how easy it is to use the system. Hey, I hear the system can be taught to recognize the unique differences in my environment. Absolutely, Sonia. So this machine learning algorithm that we've implemented in NetBackup does not rely on outside data sources. It relies on the data that is generated from your NetBackup system for your specific workload. So let's take a look. So here, there is this job that we just found as an anomaly. You can just click on it and report it as a false positive. The sensitivity of the system can also be adjusted. So you basically can have a threshold at what anomaly score triggers an actual anomaly for you. But that's how easy it is, and it's customized for you. That's great, Liji. Thanks for joining our discussion on anomaly detection, a best practice that will definitely help you mitigate threats before the bad actors have a chance to take action.